Dr. Mindy here, and on this video, we're gonna dive into dopamine and how fasting can help you reset dopamine. It is fast training week. We are practicing the dopamine reset fast. It is the fifth fast in the Fast Like a Girl, so I'm really excited to share this one with you. And if you are new to my channel, just hit the notification bell and the subscribe button. Um, there is so much information for you here on this channel. I really have poured my heart and soul into this YouTube channel. I poured my heart and soul into this book for your benefit to help you have live a happier life, live a healthier life. And what's really cool about this, re, this particular fast is that it really has it, the possibility of resetting dopamine for you. And I wanna show you why on this particular video. So and let's dive in and let me explain to you how dopamine can be your friend. It doesn't have to be something you chase. It actually can be reset periodically so that you really truly experience all the joy that life can offer you. So let's dive in. Do a long fast one day, your blood sugar going up and down. We're in it together. Okay, I wanna, I wanna talk about dopamine for a second. I used to say for years that I was like a dopamine addict and I, and I may still be a little bit of a dopamine addict, but then I realized that dopamine really is the molecule of more. It is, it's, and, I, and I wanna say it's a little bit of a liar because I feel like just when you get the dopamine hit, it's like it's never enough. You get it, you're excited, and then the next day there's like a hangover, like a dopamine hangover. And we live in this really interesting time in the world with our phones and how much information is coming into us and the likes and the follows and the access to so much food. We, we are so dopamine saturated. And so there's been a lot of talk over the years of how we can really reset this dopamine system. Um, there's even been trends of people going out into the woods and like with no, no, no access to people and no access to, to our phones and um, really powering ourselves down so that we don't keep stimulating dopamine. Um, dopamine fasting where you get off all social media, you get off all emails, you get off all technology became a trend a couple of years ago. Um, and as hard as that might sound to do, there is some logic in it because the problem with dopamine is in order to get dopamine to work for you again, you have to go through periods of time where you are not asking dopamine to show up, which AKA that means be bored. That means you know, a little bit of a mood depression. That means no sensory information coming in. It's really can be challenging. But what I love about this 48 hour fast is we can use this to reset the whole system. You just have to go without food for 48 hours. Those of you who've been training fasting with me, this is not that hard. If you're new to fasting, I get it sounds hard but stick with me here because we're seeing miracles in people's moods as they start to maybe once a month, once a quarter, once a year, throw this 40, 48 hour fast in. And the research on it is, is pretty darn impressive. There's two things we know about dopamine and food and fasting. The first thing is that we know that people who have food addiction, that eat all day, people that are more obese, they need more food to be able to get more joy from their food because those dopamine uh, receptors are saturated. So what's really interesting, one of the studies that I quote in Fast Like a Girl, what's really interesting is that they took a group of obese individuals and they put them in a 48 hour fast and what they found was not only did the whole system work better, but they created new D2, dopamine two receptor sites were born. That means not only did they clear up the dopamine receptors that were saturated, they actually create in 48 hours created new dopamine receptors. And when they reintroduced food, they actually didn't need as much food to get the same joy. The same thing goes with your phone. The same thing goes with all the stimulation that's happening. When we throw this 48 hour fast at, at, at your brain, you not only clean the old dopamine receptors out, but you get new ones, these new D2 receptors. So you are like primed and ready for more joy coming out of this fast. Can you see why I'm so excited about this? And I put it specifically at the holiday time 
because we're moving into the holidays and I get that a lot of you, it, it can be a stressful time. We have maybe poor, bad memories of the holidays or maybe we've had some frustrating moments. Maybe it's financially stressful. Maybe it's uh, um, families are stressful. So I wanted to do this fast for you in December as not only a celebration of this book coming out on December 27th, but I also want you to have an incredible holiday season. But as always, don't give up on yourself. This fast is going, it could just be the difference between the, your holiday season that's coming up, being joyful um, and not. That's how powerful a 48 hour fast can be. So as always, I hope that helps.